Hi there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is going to be on Push by Ryan Gosling. It's actually a Matchbox 20 song, but it was done by Ryan Gosling for the Barbie movie. I'm going to teach you the whole song, it's a great tune, and it's a really easy little song to play. So I'm going to teach you the whole song, but just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, press the notifications, and I do love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know where in the world you're from, what you thought of the video, and any ideas of songs would be amazing as well. And if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, support the channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this and loads of other songs, then you can support me on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is tuned down a half step, so it's tuned to what we call E flat. Everything, every note is down a semitone. So we get E flat, A flat, D flat, G flat, B flat, and E flat. Okay, so the verse of the song sounds like this. So to play that, first chord is a G chord, but we're gonna place our little finger on E3, third finger on B3, second finger on E3 nearest to your face, then first finger on A2. So that's your G chord. And we're gonna go down, down, up, down, up. So you've got. We then go to a D sus4 slash F sharp, where we keep our little finger and third finger where they are. We're gonna put our first finger onto E2, and our second finger on G2. And we're going to just do two down strokes on that. So the first bar slowly goes. Okay, up speed. Really slowly. We then go to an E minor seven, which is an easy change because the first finger goes down one string to A2 and second finger goes up one string to D2. And it's gonna be using the same rhythm as the first bar. So on the E minor seven, we're gonna go down, down, up, down, up. We then go to the C add nine chord. Again, third and fourth fingers stay in the same place. Second finger on A3, first finger on D2 playing from the A string downwards, and just two hits on that, two down strokes. So bar two slowly goes. So let's play the whole line slowly. So G to D sus four slash F sharp, and then E minor seven to C add nine. You got this. A bit faster. Speed, three, four. So that's the verse, and you just keep repeating it around the verse. So let's just play it twice through so you get the idea. So it goes. So that repeats, like I say, around the verse. We then go to the bridge, which sounds like this. So for that, we've got a D sus2 chord. First finger on G2, third finger on B3, and we've got the open E and the open D strings, so playing from the D string downwards. Two bars of that, just sort of hitting down strokes like playing crotchet, so four in each bar, so it goes. So you hit it eight times. You can add a bit of extra in if you want, like, Um, but it sounds great if you just play it straight as well. 
We then go to a C chord. First finger B1, second finger D2, third finger A3. Playing from the A string downwards. Again, two bars of that. In bar seven, we go back to the D sus2. And into bar nine, we're gonna play a C chord. We're gonna play it eight times, playing quavers, twice as fast. And then you hold the last one on, so it's. And then we're gonna play three D chords. Second finger E2, first finger G2, third finger B3. So if I play bars nine and 10, they go. So let's try the whole of the bridge. Here we go. Two, three, four. That then takes us to the chorus. Now the first two bars of the chorus repeat, and we get this. So G chord, three hits. And then we're gonna do three hits on the D chord, playing faster like this. So the rhythm is like T, T, coffee, coffee. So, it's so G, 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 D, D, D. And then in bar 12, it's the same rhythm, but we're going C add nine to D. So it goes. So bars 11 and 12, uh, and we'll repeat it, sound like this. We then carry on into bar 13, and we've got this. So E minor, which is just A2 and D2, two hits, going and then a rest, and then a D chord, same idea. C add nine again. Then we go back to that D chord again, the last chord of the bar. It's gonna go up, down, down, down. So bars 13 and 14 go. Uh, and those two bars repeat. So the whole chorus goes, uh, the first two bars repeated, and then the second two bars, bars 13 and 14 repeated. Uh, it then goes back to the verse, then bridge and chorus. And then after the second chorus, there's a little um, sort of middle eight part, which is just going. E minor three times, D three times, C add nine three times, D three times, but doing the same kind of rhythm that we had in the first part of the chorus. Uh, there's a couple of little tiny stops in it, but you'll hear it if you play along to the track, but it's basically playing the same chords. There's just a couple of little breaks and little rhythm changes, but just basically play this through the whole of that middle eight. Uh, and then it goes to the chorus till the end of the song. Well, I hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson and found it useful and informative. If you have, if you could subscribe to my channel, it really does help me out, as does giving me a like on the video, the thumbs up button, press that, it's just below. I do love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know you're watching it. Let me know where in the world you're from. Let me know what songs I should do next as well. And if you love what I'm doing, you wanna support me, support the channel and print this, the tabs off for this and loads of other songs then you can support me on my Patreon page. Come and give me a follow on Instagram as well. It's Andy Hillier Guitar. Well, thanks for watching this. I do really appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time.